こんにちは。Hi, I'm Aki from Japan. Today, I'd like to introduce to you my new and evaluated minimal room. In one of my recent videos, I introduced my minimalist apartment. If you have already seen it, I'm really glad. Recently, I moved into a new house and reorganized my new room. Now you can enjoy seeing my more sophisticated minimal lifestyle. This is my new minimalistic room. The best thing about this room is the wooden based architecture. If you want your room to be more comfortable, I really recommend having a wooden floor or wall in your room because it makes you feel so relaxed. When I get back to my room, I always feel so warm and calm. I almost don't want to leave my room. When I open the curtain, you can see the wonderful mountains and the sky outside. I decorated the room with an air freshener. And most terrarium that I made. I think most terrariums are one of the best things to heal your heart. Its design is very cute and soothing, and it's something that doesn't take a lot of time and effort to make. Next to the window, there's my workplace. I try to make it look simple. This is my MacBook and writing instrument. I used to have many writing utensils, but after some trial and error, I ended up having only these. My favorite is Mitsubishi's Jetstream ballpoint pen. I've used various Japanese ballpoint pens, but this is the one that is the most comfortable to write with. All my electric equipment is in the box to make it look organized. I used to have a lot of books in this box, but now I use the Kindle app on the iPad. I like it because it doesn't take up much space. Daily necessities such as medicine, sewing set, extra card, soaps, and training goods are stored in this box. And there is some Ghibli stuff in this box. This is my closet. When I moved, I carefully reselected the clothes that I really needed. And this is all I need suits, everyday wear, and kimono. My bedding is still just a mattress and a sleeping bag. It's a futon shaped snow peak sleeping bag. And a two layered Gokumi mattress. I bought a yoga mat for yoga. Since I had a collapsed lung, I started doing yoga for my health. Also, I recently added tatami floor mats to practice the way of making tea. Let's move to the bathroom. It's a unit bath. This is a Japanese high tech toilet with a modern bidet. The water temperature and intensity of the shower can be adjusted to your liking. And of course, the toilet seat is comfortably heated. It's too comfortable for me to live here. Sometimes I take a bath, and sometimes I just take a shower. Also, if I don't have time to take a shower, I may just use a towel to wash my body. This is the technique I learned while spending time in the hospital. I haven't used shampoo since I traveled around the world on a bamboo bike. Because it took up space and I was heavy, many people ask me, doesn't it smell? But I've never been told your hair is stinky, something like that. Among the toiletries, my favorite is this bamboo toothbrush. It doesn't hurt you and nerve because it's made of natural materials. Finally, the kitchen. Actually, this is a share house, so we share some kitchen stuff. I used to use ceramic cups, but I found that ceramic ones might crack when I carry them. So I tried wood and bamboo cup instead. I highly recommend this bamboo cup. It's cute, light, and easy to use. Finally, I'd like to introduce my favorite space in my share house. This is the living room and the outside terrace. I'm looking forward to doing yoga on this terrace in summer. I've been enjoying living with bare necessities since I started practicing the way of making tea. I will continue to upload these kind of videos and videos about Japanese culture. If you'd like, please like, comment, and subscribe. Bye-bye.